think all the, the you know, the, the lead ups in my life have, have got me to a point where I'm very comfortable in failure. And, you know, I heard a quote once, you know, fail quickly. I really like that because, you know, I think a lot of organizations and teams aren't preparing their staff and their peers for failure. And moreover, the leadership within those organizations aren't accepting the risk when it does happen. Um, and so I think there's a lot of communication um, training to be happen to happen at this point to kind of encourage leaders to go, hey, look, I want you to go find gaps and opportunities. I want you to have high initiative and creativity. But if this all goes wrong, it's on me. It's not you. It's on me. Um, mm -hmm. I want you to do that, but that comes with a risk. While we're, you know, chasing shiny things, you know, there's business as usual management that needs to happen in the background. And all of these crazy ideas that we're having to, you know, expand or find new opportunities comes at a risk of some of that. And if, if this un becomes unstuck for whatever reason, um, know that this is on me, it's not on you. There is a level of security, you know, security bubble over you guys. Um, and I've got that. And I think, you know, these lessons learned throughout, you know, fighting and, you know, going into the military and being very accountable for your actions. Um, I've tried to bring across into the corporate world because in many places, it's just a foreign concept. Yeah.